What is up guys, it is I, Jane Poop again, back with more of Kirby Triple Deluxe, and in the last video, we have completed all of DDD's drum dash, which was very difficult on an emulator because of the button input lags and all that. So I had to slow the emulator down in order to finish the last level, which I eventually did. And so in this video, we're going to start off DDD tour, uh, which is pretty much going through the main game as King DDD. So this is going to be fun in it. So let's start new adventure. DDD goes on tour in DDD tour. It's a royal time attack and you'll find fewer recovery items than in the main story mode. Find warp holes to jump the, the, the stages farther ahead. Uh, they make a great shortcuts. You'll battle deluxe bosses along the way and you'll have to face his revenge in the end. Oh god. So this is pretty much the the main game, but with King DDD. So, and the other difference is that we're not collecting stars; we're collecting bunny heads or fingers doing the peace sign. I don't know, whatever they are, but we're we're collecting something different. But they act like stars. The other difference is that uh, you've basically got a time limit that goes forward, so basically telling you how fast you can do this. So, uh, we're going to try and do this as fast as possible. I'm going to try and do all of this in one video as well, but if I can't then uh, obviously there will be, it will be another video as well, but, but I'm going to try and do this all in one video, if it's possible. So yeah. So this is pretty much like uh, a Meta Nightmare in uh, Nightmare in Dreamland and the sequel uh, Meta Nightmare Ultra in Kirby Superstar Ultra. Only this is with King DDD. So, yeah. We've got 69 of those. Uh, we also don't have any Hypernova sections either. Uh, because, well, they're not going to work with King DDD. And we also don't have to collect uh, any sunstones or rare keychains anymore either. We only have to, we only have to go through the stages. That's it. So it's just going through the stages, literally, nothing else. So yeah. So if you're looking at guides on what's 100% and that, it's mainly just the main story mode. Uh, and looking up how you 100% other things, but but other than that, you don't really need any guides to 100% anything else. Uh, so yeah, I think I think the levels are like connected as well. So instead of end goals, we so those places. Oh, we still have tilt controls though. <laughs> DDD in a paddle. Oh, I'll get that. Yeah, we still have to do tilt controls, unfortunately. Yeah, you can see we've got a one up there instead of a sunstone. So. There we go. And then. And then. Okay. All right. No, no. Oh, my God. Oh my god! Right, there we go. Like, it's so difficult on an emulator to speed things up. Okay. There's a 
secret there, but we don't obviously need those. So DDD's flapping his wings. Because he's a real penguin. Okay, we still get Waddle Dee doing these stuff, but... Alright, we should have a deluxe boss. Mr. Frosty DX. In which we're just beating the crap out of him. Okay, and he's defeated because we can't inhale enemies either, so they just get destroyed immediately. But now we're at the save point. So, meaning, if we decide to quit the game, we'll start here. So let's go on ahead. To the next level. Oh, oh, he's above me. Alright. Is anything in those now? There's a keychain there, but I don't care. Okay, we still have these rocket things. Which I don't know why, but... Alright. Let's just throw one on. Obviously, there's nothing interesting there, so... Alright, there we go. Alright, there we go. Uh, don't go in there because it would just, we'll be just wasting our time if we go in those bonus areas, so. We're gonna try and get the fastest time score. Okay. Who are we fighting next? Pornhead. No! There we go. Oh, right there. Do, 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 do. Oh, we got this. In which we're still very fast. Anything that way. Just that. Seriously. Okay, let's go here. Uh, oh, this again, yes! I definitely want that. Because it's faster. Oh, it's just for that, seriously. Whoa! Do, 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 do. Right, I'm not going to use that at all. 
I'm not even going to use this either. Because it involves tilting. Oh, God. I need the key, don't I? Or is the key optional? The key is used for a portal. Oh, there's a warp star. Where does the warp star take us? I assume the portal will take us somewhere, but I don't know where. Oh well, whatever. Let's go here. Oh yeah, the bosses, yeah. Well, maybe the portal just takes us straight to the boss or something? I don't know. Well, it might be a secret, I don't know. Which I don't really need secrets. We should fight deluxe versions of the bosses as well. You can see Flowery Woods is a different colour. Alright, let's just get in there. Do 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 Come on. Do 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 Oh no! Alright. Just keep hitting in there. Oh, he's nearly down. Yes! Right. Nice. I remember that from Superstar Ultra, that fanfare. Even though it's not it wasn't a fanfare originally. Alright, so next time we play, we'll go back here. So let's go to Lollipop Land. We finished Fine Fields. This one is Grand Wheelie DX. There we go. Unfortunately, we can't speed up anymore, but whatever. Do 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 do. Oh, oh! At least we can use the lollipop to. Um, speed things up. Here we go. We got over there. Now let's go, 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 go this way. Do, 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 do. I don't care about that treasure chest. Here we go. And 
And now we're in this building. Okay. All right, there we go. This way, oh god. And through the door. It's like we're just doing things for the rhythm. No, I don't need to do that. We got this again. And off we go. <laughs> to this other stage. Uh, we're, we're like under 20 minutes already and we're, and we're like on the second world right now. Wow. I expect to do like three worlds in like half an hour. So, so I expect to finish uh, this and Old Odyssey before... Um, before it hits 30 minutes on the OBS recording count. So, yeah. Oh, God. Oh, are you kidding me? And I don't think we can take that. Where does this take us? Is this just a shortcut? Alright. So far, we're doing so good. I'm gonna take the key with us. I don't know if we need this key, uh, I don't know if we have to go through this door, but regardless, I'm going through. And it's just for a normal keychain. Okay. Just, uh, place that. Yeah, if I still have an healing item in my inventory, and we go up to a Waddle Dee, then I'll use the item. Regardless of my health. Alright, first off, is there anything up here now? Just a tomato. Okay. Alright. Let's go in the building! And hear the awesome music! Do, 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 do. King D D D through the ghost house, he's going all along the way. He keeps running along in the creepy, creepy ghost house. And there's platforms everywhere that do nothing but scare you. There's even fake doors that do nothing but scare you away. Going through this area, the interesting mirror, with enemies you can't see. Unless you look at the mirror! There's a lot of enemies over here and a fake door. 
King King dead dead along the journey it going through that door do 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 going through every door and there's a guy with a key who's faster than DDD this wasn't normal before but now it's fast than normal oh, now let's go this way again oh he killed himself I was too late do, 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 do. Going through that door we go. Do, 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 do. It's not that door, it's probably this one. Oh yes it is. Now let's go over this way into that door over there. To find more doors that we can go through. Maybe it's this one over there. Oh oh yes it is. Oh oh yes it is. Oh yes it is. Now let's go through this damn thing. Now the mirror is more interesting because I can only see some enemies from the background. That door goes nowhere, but this way goes somewhere. Now let's go this way again. Find more enemies that are ghosts that are so annoying and we don't get any items anymore because we have a D D D D D and it's just a tomato are we gonna go to the boss yes okay not that I needed that but all right it's just for stuff there all right let's go and fight Paintra and see what Painter is like in a DX form. God, it's dark. I was expecting purple colors to make it look like paint, uh, drossier a bit, but not too much. Okay. Still hurting her. Oh, and she's doing that. I can do this at least. Do, 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 do. Oh. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, come on. Got that. Come on. Come on. Do 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 Slightly faster. We got one keychain. We got what'll do. And we got a Meta Knight Ball. There's a lot of snow in DDD land. King Right now to Old Odyssey. This and it existed before Super Mario Odyssey. And you can't get me from there, ha ha ha. A lot of uh, Waddle D tank engines. Ah, you can't get me! Alright. There we go. Alright, so I'm gonna go this way. <laughs> DDD's like, I don't wanna go this! He's like, 
we should get most of all Odyssey done before we hit 30 minutes on the, the counter. Let's see. But we won't fight a uh, Mask DDD at the end, we'll fight something else. But the other bosses will, will be the same. I don't think, we don't fight Queen Sectonia either, we fight also something else there. Uh, so two bosses are exclusive to this. And replacement of Mass DDD and Queen Sectonia. Uh, meanwhile, the other bosses are the same, just their DX versions, obviously. So, meaning they're different colours, but they are the same. Just slightly harder. <coughs> oh, no, just burped in it. It was amazing! Oh my god! That could get me, but I'm not letting it happen. And now the foreground is trying to attack me in the background. Oh, <laughs> all right. Ah, oh, you got to tilt again. I hate the tilt sections because it means I have to manually get my arm off the controller and switch to the mouse. Uh, you know what, crap all that, I'm not doing all that. Just gonna flap your wings, DDD, flap those chicken wings. Flap those wings, KFC. <laughs> oh my god. Right, I'm just gonna heal myself, because I'm so low on health. Uh, I'm not going to go through there. Alright, there we go. Okay. Okay. There we go. Bonkers the X! Oh, I got him there. Nice. Hit that. We don't even need to get bonkers uh, ability because we have the hammer already, so we can pretty much destroy any of these. So, yeah. Alright. Don't destroy that one. Then, ag then again, there's no chest there anymore, so yeah, I guess it's completely optional to destroy that. Oh, I guess it's not because it leads to a portal. Okay, leads us to a cave. We're in a hidden cave in Diddy's land. Oh, God. oh, DDD can do this. I forgot about that. There we go. Alright, there we go. Oh, we got a one, 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 one up, then to the door we go with King, 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 D, D, D. Apparently, we're so fast here. Oh, wow. 
Okay. And through that door we go. We hit 30 minutes already, but didn't quite finish it under that time, but whatever. At least, um, I think we got the majority of it done. I hate these guys. Oh! Okay. Flap those wings, KFC! Oh my god! Uh. And okay, hold on guys. Okay guys, I'm back. My apologies that right. Let's go back through old Odyssey then and see. Um Um Oh that's death. Okay. Fair enough, we're gonna go for here then. Um Oh, I forgot you could do that. Wow. Okay, uh, go over here. Oh, lollipop! Flap those wings, KFC. <laughs> Flap those wings, KFC. <laughs> Even though I don't like KFC at all, I think it's disgusting for me. <laughs> But for you guys, it's probably good. I prefer McDonald's. And the chips at Burger King. But not the burger at Burger King. Alright, anyways, uh, going through that secret area. I'm not going to bother going through the secret stuff. That's just where the rare keychain used to be. And then... I'm going to go to the other side. Just eating a chocolate Easter egg right now, even though it's not Easter, I swear, but whatever. Okay. I'm in a snowy area, which we can easily speed run. All right. Oh, whoa, that was so close. Ah, oh, I wanted to go up there, but... Alright, there we go. Alright, so let's go in here. Oh, we're not at the boss yet. Uh, get out of my way, what are these? What are these? We can easily destroy these ice blocks now because obviously uh, we have fire to our hammer as well. <coughs> oh, and I just burst and it was amazing. Oh my god. I'm going to heal myself and then you're going to give me a Coca Cola. Or a Pepsi Max, I don't know what it is, but alright. Flame Gavaros, and I did not damage him, didn't I? Oh, okay. Wow, okay, that that was a, that apparently worked. Oh, I don't even need to go here, but whatever. And then, oof. okay. I just love it when King DDD is able to flap his wings like it's KFC. Oh, I should have took the cannon, really. But I'm not going to. Flap those wings, KFC! <laughs> okay. I'm going to have to keep saying that every time um, King DDD flaps his wings, because it's just like the chicken of KFC. I don't know. <laughs> oh, that reminds me as well, guys. So, when I was in school back in... Uh, uh, 
like before late 2021, before I moved to college and all that. Um, we at the end of every every school day, we always do something called the creed, which is like something like praying to God. So, so even those that don't really believe in God too much, regardless of religion, they still had to do it. Oh, at the boss. Uh, and, and one time, uh, I think it was. Uh, I think there's one line where we said build a house, but one student in my class said build a KFC, <laughs> and I just laughed at that so bad. Even though the creed is meant to be serious, but still, it's, it was it was a bit funny. But we always made jokes about it. And Krakow's all green. All right. <laughs> oh, I just burnt, and it was amazing. Oh my god. But yeah, every time we do the creed in school, for ever since that class I've been in with that student, um, we've always uh, made our, we, we, he's always made his own version of the creed. And then I think another line it said, make a school, then amen, or amen, depending on how you want to say it. Um, at one time he said, uh, make a McDonald's, <laughs> and then I laughed at that as well. Even though we weren't meant to be that funny with it, but still, it's what some people did. I don't know why, but still. Like, obviously, we all did not want to do it, but we were forced to do it, regardless. So, I don't know if every other school's like that, but... Oh, what? That disappeared. And good thing I healed myself right before that. Boom! You're dead, Cracko Wacko! Ha 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 ha! Chocolate's melting a bit. Oh my god. Can we hear the awesome music again? Oh, it's a beyond. Alright. We'll puff those wings, KFC. Alright, here we go. But yeah, that, that that's an interesting fact about. Uh, school is that for very serious things that we had to do we sometimes make them funny uh, and making up your own words in the creed is one of them <laughs> so uh, yeah I, I have no clue why but still because it's meant to be something like religion based I think um, uh, and I think the I think the only reason we did it was because most people in my, in my school at the time were Christians and obviously um, uh, Christians should believe in God, though sometimes they may not. I, I guess I kind of do, but not as much. But still, you see the point here, because <laughs> uh, I think it's like a Christian school or something. I don't know, but but then we have people that just like to make the because we all don't didn't want to do it we literally all did not want to do the creed at all we were literally forced to do it in fact we were forced to do a lot of stuff in school that we don't want to do like sometimes we we were even forced um oh, is it even possible for me to get him okay it is i just have to do that right like like sometimes we're even forced to sing songs for things like we used to have something called uh, I, I, don't, I, I don't know if my school still do the, the old school do it obviously I don't know because I'm not there anymore thank god I'm in college now so meaning I get better things but they have something called Makaton Day which I don't really get for the most part well I kind of do and it's all about learning how to sign stuff and we always have a song that we always have to sing I have no clue why uh, and yeah, they had like multiple like famous pop songs back in like the, the 2010s era and such. 
uh, and all that. And I literally did not want to do it, but I was forced to do it. Can you believe it? And, and some of my friends in the, in the school didn't want to do it either, but they were forced to do it as well. You kind of get my point. Things you don't want to do in school, you have to do. You're forced to do it. Yeah, it honestly feels like going through labour. But, but in a school fashion. <laughs> like, we're, I, I'm literally in the United Kingdom, and, and things like slavery is pretty much illegal. But, but school isn't. And you're forced to do stuff there because that's what slavery is, right? Forcing you to do stuff. And it, it, school is literally doing the same thing, only... Uh, uh, well, thankfully it's not like real-life slavery and all that, but I mean... Still. It's so... Irritating, isn't it? Where you gotta... Where you gotta force to do stuff. And also in my school, I don't know if other schools do this. We had something called forest schools as well. Which is basically learning about nature, and and you t and you teach outside. But you, but we also have to keep learning about uh, like avoiding fires and such, even if we know how to do that stuff already. Let's say like like they wouldn't let us go near a fireplace even if there's no fire at all. Like I get that for like practicing purposes for some people and that, but. But most of us are so in, are so mature that they don't even even the mature people they don't let uh, they don't let them have so much fun. It's it's crazy, isn't it? And um, and not to mention uh, the, the other reason I moved to college and all that is because some teachers were just a bit horrible uh, a bit horrible sometimes like not not every not every t-shirt was uh, I did have some nice ones obviously but I had some that were just like weird and sometimes very strict and believe it or not the recent teacher I had uh, even though he was so humorous uh, he um, he was also quite mean he was very strict and in fact in 2022 he actually got fired because he forced a student to do something and they didn't want to do it so and then he literally grabbed the student's hand and all that so and all so, yeah you can see uh why i decided to leave school in that in 2021 and decided to go to college because i was also turning 16 at the time and i was 15 uh the last time i was in school it was when i was when i was 15 so in 2021 and then I went to college at 16, so... And it's a, it's a lot better there. Because, well, sometimes you do have strict teachers and tutors in college as well, but they're not as frequent as in schools. And, uh, like, uh, one example I can give, let's say, you're still prohibited to use, like, bad language in college and that, but unlike school where they're like, right, outside, I want a word with you now, if, if they hear you say a bad word, uh, I think even mild words count as well. College are not like that. They're just like, language, and that's it. That's still it's still a shame, but at least it's better than having someone take you outside and having a word with you just because you said a bad word. I, I don't get... Like, I, I get that it's, it is kind of bad to use bad language and such, but... Even when you're not like calling teachers names or something, they still they still won't let you. It, it's weird. Even if you're not calling in anyone names that are language or, uh, and you're literally just saying it to yourself. Like I, I do that quite a lot. To be fair, every nearly everyone does it these days. <laughs> these the schools don't still don't let you. It, it's weird. I I honestly don't like it. And obviously, some uh, colleges will prohibit that as well, but. At least they're a lot nicer when it comes to telling you to stop using bad words. They're, they're just like, language and that's it. Well, unless you like, continue to do it, they might do something like, uh, give disciplinaries and such, but... Uh, but at least when you do it the first time around, they're a lot nicer. Compared to school where they're like, right, outside, I want a word with you, and all that. That is definitely the case when you're in primary. It's almost like... They don't even want you to know a single bad word at all. Even though... 
nearly everyone pretty much knows nowadays. Well, unless you're like a small infant child, then you won't know until you're like five or something. I don't know. So, but yeah, it's crazy. And and it's not just things like language either. It's sometimes even things like talking about, let's say, uh, games and movies that are that have like different age ratings and such. Uh, so let's say. Obviously, we're in Europe, so we use we have something called the we have BBFC for movies, and then we have Peggy for games and such. And sometimes we have BBFC for games as well before 2012. But I mean, still, uh, some teachers would make it so that if we talk about a single game or movie, and they know it has a rating that's not even suitable for us at the time, uh, we would get in trouble for it. I'm not joking. So, so for example, obviously the most famous game series uh, for adults is uh, Grand Theft Auto, right? Or GTA. Uh, nearly everyone knows that. Uh, so, so if 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 a teacher heard someone talk about GTA and they know that it's been rated 18 by Peggy and all that, instantly uh, 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 they will have a word with that. They will literally have a word with that student. I'm not joking. And it doesn't matter if the if if the student has parents that let them play these games and watch these movies or not. It doesn't matter. Regardless, they still do it. So yeah, it's so it's kind of not fair for them, really, because um, well, at the time, my parents didn't really want me to do that sort of stuff, watch movies and play games that are like above the ratings that I'm currently aged, but they stopped really doing that when I turned 16, so that's when I started playing games rated 18 and watching movies rated 18, both ones that were reclassified later, and then ones that are still <laughs> 18 today. Uh, but before I was 16, they were strict about that, and they didn't want me doing that stuff, so... And I actually uh, never really did that too much, so... Yeah, blocky DX. Um, but but obviously I'm 18 now, so it means it doesn't really matter uh, now. So uh, yeah, but I mean back then, God, like I get for things like superability and things like oh yeah, things like copycat violence can occur. But but to be fair, a lot of students are quite mature and they don't even do that stuff. They just they just watch it because they just want to for entertainment and just because the movie's good. So. Uh, or the games are good. They don't act. The uh, most students that I know that play it when they're under the age uh, don't even do things like copy and such. Unlike unlike like primary children, if they did that, they'll probably will copy that. I remember when I used to uh, copy kids' films and such, like famous lines from kids' films or things they do in that. And sometimes I would get into trouble for it, even though it's from a kids' film. So, so, yeah, that, that is, that is part of the reason why I don't really like school, because they prohibit you on many things, and all that. In fact, in fact, our last, uh, the last teacher I had as well, uh, is interesting as well, because, um, one time we were... Uh, we were told if we wanted to watch uh, Bumblebee uh, one time, you know, the Transformers film spin-off uh, from 2018. But then later he's like, nope, we can't watch it because it's a PG, in which it is by the BBC. And I was like, in my head, I was like, what? Why is he prohibiting us from seeing PG rated movies? We're all allowed, we're literally all allowed to see them. Because it literally means all ages, just some scenes may be unsuitable for young audiences, right? But he still won't let us see it because he thinks that we need permission from our parents. When we literally clearly don't. Because we were all... We were, we, we, we were literally all teenagers. And, and PG is pretty much... Uh, parental guidance is pretty much only needed for children under 8 years old. That's what the BBFC say. But, apparently our teacher would not let us 
until unless parents say yes, which I don't get because I'm pretty sure literally everyone in that class uh, is like at least 14 or up uh, because it was in upper school as well, which is uh, pretty much an equivalent to high school up uh, for some of you, but we called it upper school there. But yeah, it's interesting that he won't let us watch PG rated movies, despite like our teachers in like middle school did do that because we watched films like Home Alone and such, and they they're rated PG. But st it's interesting, like he won't like the the recent teacher I had wouldn't let us watch PG rated movies, but they, he would let us watch twelve rated movies, which is after PG. It's interesting, isn't it? And obviously he wouldn't let us watch like 15 rated movies because obviously there were some 14 year olds in there, but still. Uh, uh, and and he doesn't and obviously even even if even if they even if they have parents that let them uh, see those movies and play those games, um, uh, the school will still not let uh, people under those ages uh, see them because obviously. Uh, I guess it'll be against the rules to do that uh, by school guidelines. So yeah. But it's interesting how schools do that. Like, I get it for like uh, suitability purposes and all that. But but some but literally when I was in middle school, some some students um, had parents that let them do that because because also. It's not even illegal to play or watch these things. It, it would be the same thing as, like, I don't know, um, watching your parents get changed or something. Obviously, you shouldn't do that. It's wrong, but it's not illegal now, is it? And, oh my god, he's fully metal. The, coil, the Coily Rattler, that's his name. But it's fully metal. Oh my god. But yeah, you get my idea, guys. It, it's not... It's like... Yes, yes, it's it's disturbing and inappropriate to see things like that, like your parents get changed and such. But and plus, we all see it by accident. But it's not illegal now, is it? You're not going to go to prison for that now, are you? If, if if regardless if it's an accident or on purpose, you'll you'll probably just get in trouble, which is the worst thing. But you're not going to go to prison now, are you? Just for just for looking at someone getting changed. It's it's like the stupidest thing that could happen just for something that well it is wrong but it's not really it's not like bad bad now is it it like <sighs> still it's it's funny isn't it so yeah and that's the thing i always think about when when i come to thinking of topics like oh yeah uh, watching and playing stuff that is your under age for that and such an Uja, that's like a black master hand, isn't it? Oh my god. <laughs> Forgot about that. Um and um So uh, so every time I always think of people coming up with conversations like, oh but it's illegal to watch things when you're underage. It actually isn't at all. Like selling things to them is uh, because that's against the law. Uh, and I and I even knew that myself. Uh, like, uh, even though I am 18 years old right now, and I turn 19 later this year, as of this video, um, I still sometimes get asked for ID when I'm buying games from CX uh, because they can't actually prove that I'm actually old enough unless I show them ID. So, so, so while you still have that, that that is unfortunate. At least, um, at least the ID says you're old enough. So, uh, and imagine if I was 17 or something, and I bought something rated 18, they'll probably still not sell it to me. They will probably only sell me stuff up to 15 from my BBFC and 16 by Peggy. But still, right? Who is it now, Mr. Frosty? Wow. Um, but yeah, yeah. And I bet there's something else that schools don't realise, and, and I actually never knew about this until years later in 2022, and I fully understand it now, and I'm always interested in the topic, is that games and movies can sometimes get reclassified, and I bet some people don't even realise that, because I bet 
so say a movie got changed from 18 to 15 or something, or 15 to 12, I bet those teachers would still believe that that movie is still the highest one, and and they I bet they don't realise that they've been reclassified. So I bet they'll still think it's the high rating. Uh, so so one example I could give is uh, the Terminator from 1984. Great film. You should see that um, if you need if you if you should. Um, when that came out, it was uh, 18 when it came out, but then it got changed to 15. But some people still believe it's an 18. Uh, probably because they've not looked at, like, DVDs and such and all that. They're probably used to the the old cinema rating or they're used to VHS. But uh, it's not just that film, but many other films are examples that, that, that some that were reclassified from 18 to 15, that, but they still believe they're 18s today, even though they're technically not anymore. So... Yeah, that can also be kind of frustrating, especially if it's a school teacher, uh, and 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 sometimes they they only bother to look at the rating on the box. They don't even bother checking the website, uh, even though uh, the up their updated ratings are used on the website as the current ones. And then they have like a uh, they have like a other tabs for like cinema and home entertainment of what the old ratings were. So. So at least, uh, uh, I guess it's mainly for research purposes, but at least you know, you also know that the film was originally that rating, but now it's given this rating and such. Or sometimes, in some cases, they can be changed back to the old ones sometimes, for some reason. And, 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 and with, like, extremely older ones, you also get, like, options to, you also get to see the older, the older ratings that that were later changed in November of 82. Uh, uh, so like the X-Rating, for example. Um, so, so you get to see that in there, in, in pretty much the history tabs as well, uh, and all that. So that's another benefit. <laughs> because I remember in one of the math sessions I had in college, um, I remember that uh, my maths tutor uh, talking about how he wanted to see Jaws when that came out, the 1975 one, and he said couldn't because it's classed as an A, uh, and and I actually knew what he meant from the from the beginning. I bet a lot of people were like, oh, I have no clue what that means, but I actually knew what he was on about. He was on about the um, old BBFC ratings, uh, and which A was one of them. I think it. I think the A rating meant uh, anyone could see, but. But it's recommended for 14 and up. I, th I think that's what it means. Uh, uh, that's what it says on Wikipedia. Uh, but then again, Wikipedia could always be wrong because anyone could edit it. But that's what I think it means anyway. So, uh, so, so it's pretty much like kind of like PG, but not too much. But yeah, ev but when, once he said uh, it was classed as an A, I knew what he was on about. I literally knew what he was on about. Uh, and I bet some people were like, no clue what he was on about at all. And apparently he also said that those movies only get shown in later times or something, f uh, from what he said, but I don't know what is true, and hold on guys. Okay guys, I'm back up, whoa, okay, thank god. But yeah, it's interesting how, um, uh, so what my tu what my maths tutor said, I actually knew what he was on about. Uh, yeah, I bet no one else in that class knew what he was on about. So, because uh, so, uh, uh, this it was in the seventies back then. So it was in the seventies after all. So I bet not many people would know. So yeah. Uh, okay. Um. Yeah, that's a lot. That is a really interesting history you got from me about the school and college. I assume. Um, um, all right, uh, let's. Um, oh, I'm a lot of talking now. But I have no clue what else to say. Uh, let's go this way. 
I don't even need to get those, don't I? No. Um. Uh oh, I just burped and that was amazing. Oh my god. Do I really need that bomb? I don't, do I? I think it's just for a secret. Yes, yeah, just for secret stuff. And DDD! Oh, we do need the bomb. <gasps> okay. We do need it. I'm just going to go here. And we can't destroy that. Alright, so going this way. And then, uh, can't go that way. I assume it would... I think it's where one of the sunstones were. Uh, let's go through that door. And then... Oh, the wall is following us. Oh, no. Okay. Fuck those wings, KFC! Oh, die, KFC! Oh, no. <laughs> Alright. Alright, flap those wings, KFC. <laughs> Climb the ladders, KFC. Flap those wings, KFC! Oh, my God. I really love saying that. Get in there. I was trying to clean my mouth up. I had saliva on it. Oh my god. Fuck those wings, KFC. <laughs> oh, come on. And then this way we go. Get in there, KFC. There we go. <laughs> don't, keep, don't ask me why I keep calling him KFC. <laughs> because uh, KFC is literally a chicken. Like, literally, in KFC advertising, you have a chicken. So, yeah. That is why. Uh, what's here? Alright, save point. Okay. Okay, guys, I'm back. Right, my apologies there. Right, let's go to the portal again. And hopefully, we can, um... Uh, finish off the whole, uh, the whole, uh, sub-game here, the DDD tour. Um... <clears throat> I think I will actually get all of this done in one video, even though we went over an hour, but... Still, we'll make this like a movie, shall we? Yeah. Uh, I'm not gonna get that rocket because, uh, it'll slow me down. Alright, um... I don't need that key, don't I? No, I don't really need to do it, because that key's only needed for 100% uh, completion stuff, which is not needed for um, DDD tour. Flap those wings, KFC! Uh, I'm always going to say... <coughs> okay. Uh, there we go. Okay, keep flapping those wings, KFC. KFC. Oh, my God. Oh, it pushed me off. All right, there we go. All right. All right. All right, there we go. Um. All right. No! Oh, that was close. No, oh, no! Okay, thank God for flapping those wings, KFC. Oh my God. And I have no items to heal myself with. Not even that splendid, isn't it? Nothing in there at all. Oh god. Oh, that was close. And then flap those wings, KFC, to the door. Nice. Okay, at least we're gonna get an item here. Oh yeah, this is the mid boss, isn't it? So 
we're nearly done with endless explosions. Let's go this side. Alright, let's heal myself. Alright. I'm gonna keep on. Wow, very easy. And I'm not gonna get the treasure chest because it's just um, for optional stuff. And I like how Diddy just goes through the wall there. He doesn't even duck under. Oh, what's in there? Just another one of those bunny things or whatever they are. Okay. Or oh, knock off of the Mickey Mouse logo. <laughs> I don't know. Yeah, I got this. Oh, DDD, stop trying to blow kisses in the air while trying to flap like KFC. Uh, <coughs> and then we got a spear dude, which we're gonna avoid. Uh, I'm gonna go to this one. And who's next? It is Blocky DX. Oh no! DDD's been crushed! No! Oh my god. Oh, nice! Wow! Right, I'm actually gonna get this chest because. Or not. Because I didn't know which way round it was gonna be. Ugh. Okay, what's in this one? It's so, bonkers. And that did not even damage him at all. I died! At least I'll have full health. Oh, but I've got to go through this again. Alright, go up the stairs. Alright, one, two, three. There we go. Here we go. There we go. And now, let's get that treasure chest. And I'm not going to care about those enemies. And that's just for a one-up. All right. If you notice, I've got lower lives as well. It's because I'm I'm on another recording session. I'm not uh, using the same session. So yeah. Because I had to go out and do stuff and all that. And we're just going to flap uh, the KFC wings again. There we go, we got a maximum tomato. Go up the volcano. <coughs> At least we don't have Taranza walking around. Oh, he threw his hammer away. Oh no, he got him. Pyramid. Oh, he got his hammer back. Did he just grab it, or does he have a spare one? Ah, oh, whatever. Regardless, I'm gonna defeat him. Do, 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 do. Come on. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 Alright. Oh, he's, he's not dead yet. Where is he going? Oh, yeah, I got him there. Wow. I'm just going to keep getting him here. Do, 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 do. 
Do, 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 do. Then we got the magma area. Oh, now it's harder because it's below. Do, 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 do. Just gonna keep jumping like this. Oh, this one goes sideways. I can easily dodge it like this. Oh, nice. Alright. Come on. Okay, he's doing that. I thought he was going to do his tongue, but no. Oh, no. Oh, nice! And I can't really see the screen too much. Oh, God. Oh, nice! I got him there! And we're going to see him die. Nice! Do, 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 do. Only one more part to go with this sub game. Well, it's not really a sub game, but you know what I mean. And with and that is Royal Road. So here we go with Royal Road. <coughs> I just burped and it was amazing. I don't think we do the extra stages at all, or I might be wrong. This music sounds like it's from an extra stage. Like, I, I don't remember though, but... Oh, come on. No! No, oh my god! I'm not tilting it so far. Do 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 do. Okay, okay, we are doing the extra stages. This is probably going to be longer, but... Okay, I should have gone there, but... Or, unless it's not an extra stage. I, I can't remember if it was, if this is an extra stage or not. It does look like the first extra stage in fine fields, but I can't remember if it is or not. Okay. What? Now let's go this way again. Here we go, here we go. Ooh, ooh. Okay. Oh, whoa. Wow, that was a long one. And that's gonna fall down so I can get in the door. Do -de do 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 do. Okay. Okay, mini boss here. Blocky DX. Okay, th these are the extra stages then. Okay, there we go. Oh! Okay, these are definitely extra stages, I think. This is the best song ever made in the series since Return to Dreamland. Now let's go through this damn level because it's really hard. 
trouble me. I just want to go through this level. Oh, lollipop. I'm definitely going to use that. Let's go to platforms that I'm not going to care about. Oh, there was that there, which I think would progress further, but... There we go, and stop! He was going. This awesome music uh, again. Let's go through this damn level. Because we just want to go through this level and hopefully finish the whole game. Do, 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 do. Fuck those wings, KFC. Now let's go through this damn level. Okay, I'm not gonna go there. At least I'll practice it if I play this game again. <laughs> wow. I'm just gonna do that. Let's go down here. Let's go down here. And go down here so Please hit the thingies over there. Please get the thingy magic over there. I really want to progress through the stage. I don't know what's down there, so I'm not going to bother. Okay, just another Coke. Yeah, at least we're not getting crushed by these ever, because it's impossible to do that. Playing Galvaros. Nice. That was very fast. Yeah, these are just um, extra stages. If we go through the Royal Road stages as well, oh my god, that that will take forever. Now we're in an Ice World, which is Old Odyssey's extra stage, I assume. Or is it just the extra stages? I don't know. Because, oh my god, if, if it's the Royal Road stages as well, then oh my god, this is the longest one. Not that it matters, because this is going to be a long video anyway, but... Still. Cry. Crikey. Okay. There we go. In fact, what's in that igloo? Because uh, we can go in these igloos, of course. It's literally just for that, which gave us a one-up. Can we destroy that? No, we can't. All right. Flap those wings, KFC. Oh, of course, that thing has to destroy it. Okay. Okay, I'm not going to go that way. I'm just going to go through the door. Okay, the train land again. Waddle D, the tank engine again. Ugh. All right, here we go. Whoa! Got through there quickly. Oh, it just leads us down here. And it's not really possible to do this part. Why have I went down here? Whatever. Okay. Okay. All 
Right, get it from over here. Oh god. Is there anything up here? Just a crash bomber. There we go. Gonna fuck those wings, KFC, and then gonna get that coke. Right, I'm just gonna do this. Oh, nice. Okay, got that. I'm just gonna have that now. Flap those wings, KFC. Oh god, I'm gonna keep saying that. I think that should be the name of this video. Flat those wings, KFC. I don't know. Uh, okay, we're at a save point. But I don't know if there's more than this. We're, we, we've been here eight minutes. Wow. Alright. Um, yeah, I feel like this is mostly just extra stages. Dude. And then again, most levels in Royal Road are just like redoing bosses, so. So I don't think it will make sense to redo those levels. Uh, well, at least those ones, at least. But it's mostly just fighting bosses again. Um, so, yeah. Though, I guarantee the last normal level of. Um, uh, Royal Road might be included though, you know, the one with the crystals in you when you save the fairies um, To open the door I, I, that one might be included. I don't know Or maybe it won't. I don't know. I, I can't remember since the last time I played this but uh, It's just uh And then let's, um... Oh, going through this again. Uh, splendid. Oh, God. Oh, I can go through that, wow. Because in the background, it's... It turns out it, there's no wall. We've got to follow the mirror. Oh, crap. Something here. Do, 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 do. Go through the door. Do, 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 do. Here we go. Oh, hold on, guys. Hi, right, guys, I'm back. My apologies there. Oh, oh god. Uh, didn't realize we were in this. Um, and it was amazing. Oh, that was close. Right. Uh, I'm not going to bother with the key stuff. It, it's just going to take forever. Here we go. Those Cobras again. Oh, boy. Hey, <laughs> you keep like to flap those wings, KFC. Oh, my God. Oh god. Here we go. Uh no, no, no. Not doing that at all. Screw the cannon stuff. Not doing that at all. Oh my god. Okay, can you dare bit of me, stupid cobra? There we go. All the cobra brothers. Mm. There's tons of cobras, oh my god. Ah, you can't get me. Ha ha ha. Oh, immediately we're swimming. Okay. Okay. Oh, come on. Uh. Alright. Who's this gonna be? 
bonkers again. They seem to like using bonkers too much. Alright. Got you! Got you, bonkers! And yet another one up. I think we're just getting one ups here mainly because they know we're going to struggle with the last part, so I guess we're being lucky here. Uh, no, I'm not doing all the tilting stuff. Okay, it's this again. Do, 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 do. I'm gonna keep. Oh wow! Uh, I didn't know you do that. Uh, I'm not gonna do all that, no way. No, don't you dare- No, don't you dare hurt me. Got that there, there we go. Um. Do, 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 do. Okay. God. Okay, oh, no, 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 no DDD, no KFC, oh my god. Jesus Christ. Okay. Oh, God's sake. This again. Right, I'm going to see if I can do this well, because um, last time I absolutely sucked at it. A, co a couple of times I absolutely sucked. And I don't know if I've saved him. Oh, I have saved him! But it's mainly just for these, so I can get a 1-up. No, no 1-up, but I got... A lot of those, at least. This one's going to be harder, though. Okay, destroy that. And okay. I got that. Right, flap those wings, KFC, to get to that star. And have I saved him? Yes, I have. So I can go here. Uh, it's going to be, like, some tilting stuff, I guess, though, so I'm not going to go there. Oh, no, not this. Oh, my God. That's the easiest key ever. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> okay, 15-15 on the time, wow. And the time doesn't lower itself a bit, no matter what. It doesn't even remember our previous time that we got here. Which is a shame. Okay. No, don't you dare. Alright, let's go here. And then... And then we're gonna go here. And then over here. Uh, grab the key. And then. Uh, just got that for no reason. I don't really need that, but. Come on. And then. 1609. Close. Oh my god. Oh, 
Oh, what? Come on. Alright. Oh, nice. <sighs> okay, I got this again. We're literally just warping places. Wow. Okay. What mini boss are we gonna get? I can't remember. Uh, Grand Wheelie! Of course it'll be Grand Wheelie. Oh! And you just have to do that. Come on. Boom! You're dead! Very easy, these bosses. Uh, go for the door. Oh, we're in the grasslands again. That's I'm just gonna do that instead. Flapping those wings can you ever see? E e e e. Let's go for the portal. God. And go from here. Oh, little slip. Oh my god, no. Oh! So close. Ooh! Okay. That was very close there. Oh my god. Oh, not this again. I remember this. Ugh. From the previous levels, oh my god. Oh, whoa. That was cool. But grab the key, there we go. No! Oh my god! And I've got no healing items at all. Alright, let's go for here. Oh, and then you... Oh my god, I wasn't high enough. There's a key here. Okay, let's go this way. Oh my god. It reminds me of that stage in Mega Man Zero, the first one. Where you have the appearing and disappearing blocks. And in that one, it's much harder than the um, uh, the other disappearing and uh, appearing blocks in the other normal Mega Man games, and in X5. That's part of this reminds me of. That part. Oh my god. Only it's with blocks uh, going forward and backwards again. So the forward in blocks, you could call it? I don't know. Going through the snowy land. And then go this way. Going through the portal. Alright, I'm not gonna. Oh no. This is gonna be very difficult. Because I have to use. I have to carry the bomb, don't I? Oh, I forgot it's right click, not left click. Oh my god. Because I'm on an emulator, it's harder. Right. Oh, I've got to do more tilting. Oh, it's close. Oh my god. I have to bring the... Oh my god. It's one of these stages in there. Right. Okay. 
Right. I'm gonna wait for that. Okay. No! Jesus. Alright, don't tilt away. Go. Alright. Alright, we're there. Oh my god. That was so tricky. Oh, then again, it's only for bonus stuff. It's not actually required. Okay. Only the first part is required. Okay. At least I practiced. Oh my god. Ugh. Wow, 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 wow. Oh no! No! I was trying to go fast. I right, got them. I'm just gonna flap my wings. Wait, can you see again? Ah, before you get me, I'm gonna go in the portal. So many portals in this stage. Oh my god. I think this is one of the last extra stages. Alright. Oh, come on. Okay. I'm not gonna bother going in there. Also, not even have, like, ways to get rid of fire. Oh my god, I was so early. I've got to do the rest of it again, though. No! It's longer now. Oh my god. I can rush through this easily. Okay. Oh, oh! Oh, you can destroy the... F you can get rid of fire. Apparently, the normal attack is ice. Apparently that's ice, or is it the wind that gets rid of fire? I don't know. <laughs> Whoa, we got in there quickly. Oh god, this part. Well, you're gonna fall down. Haha, <laughs> goodbye. Oh my god. Go here. What's this? Oh, save point. Okay. I assume this is the mini boss time. Oh, now we're in the Royal Road stages. Of course we would be. Oh my god. Ah. Oh my god. I'm gonna rush through these. Because I just don't wanna spend ages on these. Oh my god. Go. Uh, oh. Unless we only go for a couple of the Royal Road stages. And not exactly all of them. We're spending forever in this. Oh my god. Okay. Okay, there we go. There we go. I'm gonna go through there. I'm not gonna go the other way. I 
I don't really want to do some tilting. Oh my god. I'm going to have to now. Oh my god. Oh my god, more tilting required. The one thing we hate. I like how the doors change as well. Because uh, obviously it means we're not in the other ones, the normal stages anymore, so meaning uh, there's no point of the gold doors. <laughs> so. so if we. Oh, what? Oh, we do fight the mini-bosses again. Alright. Okay. Okay, guys, I'm back. My apologies there. Right. Um, now we are back with the battle against Coily Rattler. Oh, God. Oh, God. I didn't know he was doing all this. Oh, he crushed me again. Okay, I got him there. Wow. Again. Okay. Then we're gonna wait for him to go around here. Oh, there we go. We got in there. Oh no, I've been crushed. Oh nice, I got him there. Wow. And we don't get to see the death animation, probably because it's too long, but whatever. Oh crap. Yeah, let's go this way. You're gonna be joking me. There we go. Not that I needed to go that way, but we got a wreck we got a normal keychain anyway. In which we're gonna need nearly every keychain to 100 percent anyway. What's this for? Oh it's for a portal, right. But we need to plan this one first. And then this one. There we go. Alright, so let's get the key. After flapping our wings like KFC. And then... Because I'm pretty sure portals like this bring us further? I don't know. Okay, it seems like we're in a later stage. Flap those wings, KFC. Oh god. Flap KFC. Oh my god. Right, I'm gonna need that. Absolutely. There we go. 
nothing else around here. Let's just go in there, and then boom. Yeah, we have Pain Trip, because normally, after Coy the Rattler, we would fight Krakow, but we, I guess we skipped in, so... Alright, let's just get that witch. There we go, just keep hitting her. Okay. Oh, wow! That's a lot of damage. Oh, nice! Okay. Can I get her there? Oh, not quite. They got you there. Yeah, <laughs> just keep puffing, puffing yourself like KFC. Oh my god. Okay. No, we're not at the secret yet. Yeah, there we go. What are you going to give us that? And I'll also heal myself as well, because obviously it makes things better. And let's go in here, the portal, again. Who do we fight this time? It's Flowery Woods. Flowery Woods is so easy. Yeah, you're so easy. Oh. Apparently not too much. There we go. Okay. Oh! Okay, that is really good when you do that. Oh. Okay. I should have done that really, so then it burned him a bit. I think that deals more damage. Oh, nearly! Okay. Oh wow! Oh my god! That was impressive! Wow! Easily got him there. Oh boy. Okay. And... Okay, no. Go down here. Uh, I can't remember if... Um... Oh no, no, it's the it's another side, isn't it? Where there's a secret. Flap those wings, KFC! Oh my god. Alright, just heal myself there. Right, that has a secret on its own, so. Wait, is there something up there? No, there isn't. Alright, there's that there, but I wanna. Get the secret first. Because there could be something there, who knows. Oh, another portal! Let's just use that instead. Yep, yeah, because it advances further. You can see we're at, like... Oh, we're at the crystal place! Okay. That's why these portals are so important, because then... We can use these... Are there secrets around here? No. I thought there would be. Okay, let's uh, go ahead. Except we can just go in there. Yeah, we still need to save the fairies, that's it. The flower fairies. But luckily, we don't have to find any secrets anymore. We could if we want to, but... But it's completely optional. 
Okay, let's then go through the door. And then we choose our own path. I'm gonna go this way first. Since we've got our own hammer, I'm gonna see what's in place of the rare keychain. Oh no, th this is not the one. It's the bottom one, isn't it? Oh! Saw something. Yes, I'm taking that! Absolutely. <laughs> it takes us just to the fairy, wow. Because I don't need the secret. Do, 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 do. I, th I assume it's for time purposes as well. Because it would be impossible to like do this very fast if you went through all levels. So, I think that's why they did the secret portals. Oh, I see a lollipop down there. Flap those wings, KFC! Here we go. It's just a tomato. And then we saved another fairy. A cool hair. Oh, here we go. Oh, this, but I can easily dodge this by flapping my wings again, like good old KFC. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, that was so close. Oh, my God. Got that easily. We we were so fast in there. Wow. I do wish the time had paused during these cutscene parts because it's not really fair for it to still play. Yeah, flap those wings, KFC. You go, KFC. Chicken, KFC penguin. <laughs> Not that I really needed to use that, but I mean, whatever. I needed to steal Waddle Dee's stuff, so... Alright, we're gonna fight Bonkers again. We're gonna fight Bonkers! Got you. Oh, nice. Got you there. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. That's for the key. Yeah. I was wondering what that was. <laughs> What's up here now? Just a one up. But I'm not. I'm not doing all that again. No. Screw that. And then we should get one more portal to use. And that way. And that way. We can, um. Pretty much, um. Ah, gotta do this. Yeah, I'm just holding up on a D-pad to make this faster. Alright. Holding up. There we go. Oh, God! No! I wasn't fast enough. Ah, oh, what?
There we go. Clap those wings, KFC. <laughs> Oh, what? Luckily, I can use that. There's no door yet. Right, now there will be a door. There we go. Oh, there's something up here. What's up here? Just that. Now we got this uh, fairy saved. Every fairy has been saved. And now the door we go. But again, the boss, the the uh, we won't fight uh, Mass DDD or Queen Sectonia in this mode. We'll have something else. Uh, so, will we go to the boss after this? Well, we got a save point, so that's a good thing. And to the portal we go. Okay, we're at the boss already, right. I guess the other two extra stages are not included. Thank God. Okay, we've got 90 of those. Do, 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 do. Give me a tomato. Even though it still has Queen Sectonia on the door, we're not going to fight her. We're going to fight someone else. We're not going to fight Mass DDD either. So let's see who we'll fight. Oh, we do fight Queen Sectonia. I was wrong. Well, we don't fight the uh, the flower part of her. We only fight the normal side of her. In a DX form, obviously. Yeah, I forgot about that. Okay, I was wrong. Oh, we got her there. And she's gonna do the same stuff again. Bring the... Um, Diamond. I'm gonna go on. <laughs> and DDD's just like. <laughs> okay. Just easily dodge that. Oh, wow. Dodge these. Come on! Oh. oh, there we go. We got her there. And then... Ugh. She hits us there. We don't even bounce on a DDD anymore. Because he's not there. Ooh. I don't know if I'm still hitting her a bit. Oh! That worked. Oh, okay. She can change a bit now. Boom, you're dead! <laughs> but at least we don't have to fight the flower version of her. I don't think DDD will be able to do that anyway. At least the hypernova part. So, what do we get after this? You think we've done? But we haven't. Because... We have a unique boss that's only in this mode. And it is none other than Shadow DDD! Yes! So pretty much a dark version of DDD. Kind of like Shadow Kirby in uh, the Kirby Fighters mode. But it's with DDD instead. Isn't that cool? We're just beating the crap out of him. Oh, we got him there. 
Now I believe he'll have similar to Mask DDD the fight, but he's not really wearing a mask. And then he'll have this kind of hammer that he summons. Oh god. Oh god no. Oh, what's he gonna do that? Oh god. Some shockwaves. Nearly there. Okay. Oh, what's he gonna do here? Oh, it's oh, it's just like um, just like uh, DDD's fight in Dreamland Three. Oh my god. You're there! You're not even gonna do the rest. But there's more. We can go in the mirror. And the mirror looks familiar, doesn't it? And this area looks familiar. Because the mirror's there again. And this time, we have. Dark Meta Knight! Yeah, you didn't expect him to come back now, did you? <laughs> yeah, well, Dark Meta Knight's Revenge, it's called here, but... Uh, and we don't have any healing items, so I don't know how easy this is going to be. But, whatever. Oh god. Okay, there we go. So yeah, this is another exclusive boss to this mode. Uh, it's not in the main story mode, so... Oh, there we go, we got him there. And then... Here's a new move and some classic music that we're familiar with from the Amazing Mirror. The one, the one he's moving on is the real one. Right. Oh, what? I was gonna... do that, but... Okay, there we go. Oh! Okay. We got low health, but we might be able to do this. Oh god, no. Oh no! I'm nearly dead. I don't know if I'm able to beat this fight. Almost done! Oh my god! No! No, no, no! Oh my god. Now what's he gonna do here? He's gonna bring out tornadoes. Which we can easily dodge by just doing that. Oh, he done it! First try! Oh my god! <sighs> and then he's just gonna get sucked by the mirror. <laughs> He's just going to break the mirror. Okay. But how is DDD going to get out? <laughs> His dance. <laughs> He's like, how is he going to get out of the dark world, though? Yeah, okay, Shane, we've got a sim mirror. And that's it. Our best time was 1 hour and 43 minutes. 57 seconds. Oh my god. If we look at our clear time for each, that is what it is. So yeah, now let's quit. And then, the credits again, but for this side. Oh God.
That was interesting. Ah, we got images from a, a superstar, superstar, and superstar ultra. Uh, here, okay. And now we got images, okay. But yes, this has been interesting. This um, DDD playthrough. But there's still more to this game, which we're gonna do in the next video. And that's one more game mode that will be unlocked after this. And I don't know about the keychains, but but the keychains might um, also um, uh, what do you say? Um, we might we might have to get more keychains because it's random what keychains you get sometimes. So and that and all the keychains are also required for one hundred percent. So yeah. <sighs> Dude, he's like, oh, Cracko, I'm coming for you! He's like... <laughs> that is so funny. Ah, uh, that, that thing that was originally, that image that was originally in the Japanese release of the uh, Superstar, but it's present here in all versions of Triple Deluxe. <laughs> the Kirby with the kanji symbol. DDD on, uh, no, no, Kirby and Waddle D playing on their Nintendo DS's. The Mario Club! I don't get what the Mario Club is in the Nintendo credits of nearly all of their games. Oh, there's that image again, that Kirby with the kanji on the side. Yeah, that. The Howl Room. Oh, there, there's Kirby again in the kanji. Oh, my God. And again! Oh my god, it's appearing a lot of times. Oh my god. And there it is again with the special thanks. I guess they seriously like that. They seriously wanted us to see that without importing a uh, superstar from Japan. And Queen Sectonia's other form wasn't in the DDD's run. Hmm. Okay. Kirby looking at an image or watching TV? I don't know. Oh, Golden Kirby. And we all miss you, Satoru Water. Rest in peace, man. Ah, uh, DDD's castle's on the hill there. Yeah, flap those wings, KFC! Okay, the end. Okay, and that's that. And then when we quit... We got sound test! Uh, so we can listen to all the soundtrack. And, most importantly... The true arena! Can you become a Kirby Master? In the true arena, you can challenge other players with Street Pass records. Oh, of course. And the music's changed. And uh, other things have changed as well. These are normal size, but DDD's drum dash is now just a smaller icon. Uh, so we no longer get to see DDD holding the drums. That's not bad. Um, and I guess it's I guess it's to mainly make room for the um, true arena, which we will do in the next video. Which it will be very hard indeed. But trust me, we are going to do this, and hopefully, beat Kirby Triple Deluxe. I don't know if we'll have all keychains, I don't know if I'm able to get more keychains now. Okay, I am. Alright. 
Probably because I'm recording this on a different day. So, yeah. Don't need this. Okay, there we go. It's still 96. I don't know if the keychains actually don't it actually count though as needing to 100%, but regardless, we're going to try anyway. So, yeah. If you want to hear the normal track then go ahead to the other files. And if you want to see the DDD icon again, there it is. Until you go there, it's not there. So, yeah. I think on that note, we're going to end things off here. So next time on Kirby Triple Deluxe, we will do the ultimate finale, the true arena. So I shall see you guys in the next video. It is I, James, about. I shall see you guys next time. Bye!